Now when it comes on to petroleum jelly, there was a time when petroleum jelly was used for basically everything. Every situation to do with the skin. If you have dry skin, you apply petroleum jelly. If you have cracked lips, you apply petroleum jelly. If you have cracked heels, you apply petroleum jelly. If you have a, you know, any form of a scrapes or scratches, you apply petroleum jelly. After a while, petroleum jelly tend to get a, a big hit where people were like just totally avoiding petroleum jelly. However, today I personally still use petroleum jelly. However, I found a way to pep it up a bit to turn it into a more effective remedy, a more effective um, jelly for the skin. So what I'm going to do for you today, I am going to show you how to make a anti-aging facial moisturizer using petroleum jelly. So if you're interested, do not click off, continue watching the video for the full recipe. And at the end of the video, I'll share some tips and how best to use the moisturizer for a more effective result. So what I'm going to do today, I am going to show you how you can turn your plain old Vaseline petroleum jelly that is into an amazing anti-aging facial cream slash facial moisturizer. Now you're going to take your petroleum jelly. Let's reach for a bowl right here. And we're going to use a tablespoon of the petroleum jelly. Let's pour that in. Make sure to get everything out. Well, the first thing we're gonna do with the petroleum jelly we are gonna melt now an easy way to melt the petroleum jelly is to take some hot water very hot water place your bowl over the hot water and start stirring the petroleum jelly Put it down in the bowl and start playing around with it just start stirring and this is an easy way to melt it you can also choose to put it in the microwave or put it over a pot of boiling water. Same procedure. So just keep stirring. It's gonna get liquefied. That's what we're doing this. We're melting it to a liquid. And as you can see, this is melting nicely. And this is exactly how you want it to be. So totally melt the petroleum. This is a slower process than the microwave or the stove top, but it will do. Now once your petroleum jelly is melted, and take a look, this is how you want it. Totally melted. You're gonna keep it over the warm water. And now we're gonna add some anti-aging oils to this. Our first oil, we're gonna use some vitamin E oil. Vitamin E oil is very hydrating and is also act as a preservative. We're using a half a teaspoon of the vitamin E oil, pouring that in our petroleum jelly, and we are gonna continue to blend. Now we're gonna use another oil. Our next oil is a over oil, an amazing oil to use on your skin. We're using a teaspoon of the over oil, pouring this in the petroleum jelly, and we're going to give it a little stir. If you live somewhere very cold, this method is really, really great because if you do not do it over the warm water, the petroleum jelly is going to go to sleep really, really fast. So keep blending. And you can use any of your special oils in this, guys. So, so far we use vitamin E and we use some over oil. Now we're going to use another amazing anti-aging facial oil. And that is in the form of marula oil. And I'm also going to use a teaspoon of this amazing oil in the petroleum jelly. An amazing oil to hydrate the skin. And we're going to mix this up totally mix all the oils. As I said guys, use any two of your special anti-aging facial oil in this. Now guys, I'm gonna add my final ingredient. And here I have some honey. And for our honey, I'm using about a half of a teaspoon. You really do not need a lot of honey in this. Run about a half a two teaspoon. Pour that in, in the petroleum jelly and oils while it's still very warm. So keep mixing. Blend well. 
And now we have taken our petroleum jelly to the next level. Once this is done, guys, you're gonna reach, remove it from the hot water. And now, guys, what we did was to turn our petroleum jelly in an amazing moisturizer. And use a container with a wide mouth. And while it is still warm, pour it in your container. Now here we have it guys, your petroleum jelly moisturizer. Now use this AM and PM. This is amazing for dry skin. This is amazing for sagging, loose skin. This is amazing if you're looking to get rid of wrinkles on your skin. This is gonna lock the moisture in the skin and all this amazing antioxidant is gonna help to plump that skin up and keep it looking younger and fresher. Now this is gonna go back to sleep However, it's going to be more jelly-like. It's not going to be as thick as this petroleum jelly. But now you know all the amazing antioxidant A, B, and C vitamins that is now in this. And you can use this on your face, your neck, and decollete. You can also make a larger batch and use it on your entire body to lock that moisture in. So take a little bit of your petroleum jelly moisturizer applied to clean skin your face your neck and your decollete and just massage it in I suggest you use this moisturizer whenever your skin is feeling dry or if you're looking to smooth wrinkles and fine lines on the skin also if you are looking to get rid of hyperpigmentation the ingredient in this will work wonders you don't need to store this in the refrigerator leave it on your countertop and use it up with it in six months so there it is guys how I you turn my ordinary petroleum jelly into an amazing anti-aging facial moisturizer no, and there you have it a quick and easy way to take your basic petroleum jelly from just pure petroleum jelly to an amazing anti-aging facial moisturizer now guys just go ahead and use it up on your skin and then come back a couple of weeks or so after and share your result thank you all for watching if you like the video give it a thumbs up don't forget to share we also have membership guys if you click on that join button below the video it will take you to a page where you can choose a tier to be Become a member being a member you get a lot of perks you get discounted merchandise you get to choose topic for videos you just basically have a more say in what goes on on the channel so thank you all for watching and guess what if you have not yet subscribed do not leave without doing so so look below you're gonna see the word subscribe click on it and you will be subscribed don't forget to turn on post notification on your phone so that each time I upload a video you'll get the notification a b d a c or what about five to ten minutes after. Thank you all for watching and I'll see you all very soon.